Bringing you another edition of the NBA on two. Here are the starters for Mil. And so here we go, the 76ers to start it. And there's the feed to Harden. Good on the bucket. And Harden's such a creative scorer, especially when he gets in close to the basket. Harris against Middleton. Kicks it out to Giannis. That one doesn't drop. Good D by Embiid. Harden surveying the D. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Philadelphia shooting their initial free throws of the game right here. And one of the highlights last year for this group was the fact that they were so efficient from the charity strike. That's a huge factor. Makes it pretty tough on the defense. Who are you going to pick to send to the free throw line? You know, he's hitting the free throws right now. Form looks good. And there it is for him. He's going to take a little more to get a Tentacumbo off of his mark there. Adept at finishing those difficult shots. Here's Philadelphia. Harden kicks to Embiid. He's covered by Matthews. That one is good from Joel Embiid. Now, what a great option he gives them on every possession. And to Takumbo. And the slam dunk by Hunter Takumbo. Well, guarding a Tentacumbo is really difficult because of how awkward he can get around the floor and how much space he can take up. Teardrop shot and Harden with the lay-in. Harden's got his second bucket. And it's all about the release when you shoot the floater. That one doesn't go. And the 76ers go the other way with it. Stolen by Holiday. One twelve left here in the opening quarter. For a three, Middleton gets hauled in by the 76ers. And here's Harden. Pass to Tucker. Back to Harden. Terrific assist. A nice finish. Solid play all around. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. The 76ers have gone 4-4 four four to start, so a nice offensive rhythm to start here. He's covered by Matthews. Harden outside. He kicks to Embiid. Shot clock at 5. And the officials call a traveling violation. Both teams will make substitutions. For Milwaukee, they've gone two of six from the field. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Ingles passes to Connaughton. Allen for three. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. For three. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Here's Melton, defended by Allen. Nine feet out. Melton, no good. He's got so many ways to score in the post. Just nifty, uses fakes. You have to have a body on him every time he's down there. No good on the last second attempt there. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far on the scoreboard. They've got Korkmaz. And it's Thibault in at the three. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. And that one is stuffed right through. 
not the kind of aggressive defense they need to cut into the lead. Yeah, you have to protect the rim, Greg, a little better. Good job to recognize the opportunity. That's just very solid offense. Here's Melton. Lopez covering. And the dunk by Embiid. Oh, taking it to the rack with power. Hammering down the two-hand slam. Allen finds Ingles. Trying to get open is Lopez. Milwaukee, no good that time either. Having a hand up in your face makes such a difference to a shooter. Yeah, as good as you can do without getting a block there to defend. Here's Niang. That one, no good. The defense is tough as it comes right there. He's a hard man to deny when he gets the ball to the rim. Ingles can't get it to go. The 76ers leading by seven. One thirty-nine left to play in the first half. The pass to Korkmaz. Here's Melton to the middle. Here's Feibel. Score the basket, his second of two attempts. Nice pass here to set that basket up. We've got 123 left in the second quarter. Sixers making a switch here. Milton's checked in. The box also changing it up. Chris Milton comes in for Brooke Lopez. And it's Holiday in for Allen. Here's Connaughton. And they call the foul. So he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. Nice job creating for the easy deuce. So both teams changing it up here. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the game here. And so it's Harden bringing it up for Philadelphia. Harris outside. 59 seconds left in the first half. Just five to shoot. And no good that time. Now the Bucks take it the other way. Two for one opportunity here if they want it. And no doubt, Kevin, if I'm this, I go for it. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Well, a dedicated sprint to the hoop from Holiday there. He earns the trip to the line. Milwaukee shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. And just to mention, a season ago, they were very comfortable at the line, hitting about 78% of their free throws. Inside, here's Harden and the jam by Harden. And I just love how aggressive Harden is inside. When he's deep like that, he is ready to finish with authority. My goodness, he is such a great dunker. Greg, a high riser, no doubt about it. 30 seconds left in the first half of the game. Pass to Harris. Out left to the wing. Here's Milton, defended by Middleton. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Hey guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Good work there as it goes. Well, he could just see over the defense. The, the eyes to spot the open man. Giannis flourishing right now as a facilitator. And a close game so far through the first two quarters as we... And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. You gotta like what Harden has done in this game so far. On the court for the Bucks. This is down low with Lopez. Holiday out there with Matthews. And it's Middleton in at the three spot. Yeah, go ahead and get in front of that if you want to. Man, with a dunk by Giannis. Here's Harden. Good for the fifth time in five shots. He remains perfect. And that's ten straight points in the paint. The defense nowhere to be found. All alone in the jam by Harden. And running with a full head of steam, but completely under control. Yeah, you think he's comfortable at that speed? He's done it so many times before. Just an absolute blur in transition, and that helps get the rhythm going. 
The 76ers shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. And the first one drops. Both free throws good from Tucker. Bucks trail by eight. Down low. You know what? Those are shots you just hate to miss when you get those kinds of bunnies on a possession. And the powerful one-handed slam. Yeah, letting it rip. They're just having fun right now. Yeah, some of these nights you got to enjoy yourself. Not too much at the expense of the other team, but right now this team is balling. Harden draws the double. On the wing, Harris. Defended by Middleton. And a miss there on the triple. Yeah, just the first miss of the half there. They have to be happy. Three of four to start it off. Will it go? And again, the Bucks miss. Philadelphia leading by 10. On the wing, Harden, guarded by Holiday. The Bucks have gone one of three since starting the second half. Here's Middleton, and he gets it to go. Not much else the D can do against something like that. Chris Middleton so fast in getting that shot off. He's covered by Matthews. Embiid against Lopez. And too long on the shot. Bucks trail by eight. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, right now you just need a bucket to get some momentum. And up at the Kumbo gets it to go. Moving it around. Eight of their last ten coming off assists. To the inside. Basket is good. He'll get a chance for one more at the line. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. So it's both teams making substitutions here. The 76 have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. I feel like Tobias Harris's confidence has grown over the past couple seasons, especially on the offensive end. Very capable of taking advantage of smaller defenders. The shot and game clock separated by four. Here's the three. Melton's shot is good. Melton's got the lead up to 12 now for the 76ers. On the wing, Giannis. Sinks the triple. Giannis has got seven points for the quarter. Yeah, and they are living and dying from beyond the arc since halftime. It's a different look than what we saw in the first half. From the baseline, that shot off the mark. Nobody near Allen. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And so it's the Philadelphia 76ers. Fourth quarter of action is upon us. Thanks as always for joining us. The 76ers leading by nine. Harris is out there with Embiid. And it's Thibault in at the three, the small forward. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Korkmaz passes to Melton. To the middle, here's Embiid. Antetokounmpo pulls it in. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. Those are all the little things about effort there. He just gets out there and contests, and that's just enough. Here's Embiid. And he uses the glass on the way. Embiid's got the fourth quarter started here with a bucket for the 76ers. Antetokounmpo kicks to Allen. And now Philadelphia on the break. And the rejection by Giannis. Throws it up high. Rebound by the 76ers. Embiid's got his eighth rebound here tonight. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. He's a good free throw shooter. Tobias Harris smartly looking to get in there and find some easy points from the line. And he knocks down the first one. P.J. Tucker, he's checked in for the 76ers. James Harden comes in for Korkmaz. Brooke Lopez is checked in for Milwaukee. Chris Middleton comes in for Pat Connaughton. Timeout called the Bucks. They're down by 13. 158 left in the fourth. <laughs> 158 left to play in the final quarter. Middleton can't get it to go. 
they can take their time on this possession. Yeah, it wouldn't be a bad idea just give themselves a little bit of a break. Well, for Tobias Harris to take this step, getting away from scoring and finding teammates to become a more adept passer, that's good signs. Onto the Kumbo, no good. And here's Melton. He'll bring it up for Philadelphia. Here in the fourth quarter, their defense has been very strong, allowing no baskets. On the wing, Harden, guarded by Holiday. Harden bounce pass. Embiid. And Embiid throws it down. And this is going to end in a lopsided victory. I, I love the tenacity and aggressiveness, as well as the ability to close. You really got to give it up here for Philadelphia. What do you think was the deciding factor in this one? I think you have to look at their field goal percentage. They just shot the ball much better than the opponent, and they were getting great looks all game long. And you know, when you look at the huge impact he had, just a monster game for Joel Embiid. And you have to love the effort he put forth on the glass. He played with a fire no one else could match as he chased down those rebounds. For a three, Middleton, and Philadelphia grabs the miss. 52 seconds left in the fourth quarter. The first free throw is good, so both teams making some changes here. Both shots good from the strike. Carter with it. Wesley Matthews on the wing. Back to Carter. 35 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And he is not shy about pulling the trigger from downtown. Matthews has the eye and the confidence from three-point range that you just love to see. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Melton passes to Reed. Count the bucket. And he's got a free throw coming up as well. This arena was rocking throughout the night. You, you could really feel the energy. Yeah, huge motivation. Always great for a young team, but veteran players also appreciate when fans come with that kind of energy and get into the spirit of the game. Well, and this has been their strategy throughout the fourth period. We'll see how it pans out. It's one thing to have teams shoot a bunch of threes, but with this team being that hot defensively, you got to chase them away from anywhere near that line. So it's Philadelphia winning this one easily. Some good moments throughout this one, but they have the clear advantage down the stretch. Yeah, I mean, I, I love the way they executed on both ends of the floor, completely under control for the vast majority of the game. And whenever there was a misstep, they just didn't allow it to fester. And that's why they're going to walk away with the win. Thank you, David. Great interview once again. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Greg Anthony, Brett Berry, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. So long and good night, everyone.